When we think about genomics in oncology, we need to remember that we're dealing with two different genomes. Firstly, there's the genome of the patient, and these are the changes that are largely present through nearly all the cells in the body. Changes in this genome we refer to as constitutional or germline variants or mutations. As clinical geneticists, our work is largely focused on using germline genomic variants to identify and best manage individuals at elevated risk of cancer. The second genome we need to think about is the genome of the tumour and these are the changes that have arisen as that tumour has evolved and we refer to these changes as somatic or acquired variants or mutations. These changes can inform on sensitivity to therapy and the prognosis of the cancer and these types of changes have conventionally been the focus of the oncologist, the molecular oncologist, to define the management of that patient and cancer.